A South St. Louis family was forced out of their home after a fire at a vacant building jumped onto their home. As that family begins rebuilding their lives, they told Five on Your Side's Holden Kerwicki they believe this fire was no accident. Wednesday evening, Catherine Kelleher was finishing up a grocery run when she got a call no parent ever wants. He told me the house was on fire. I raced home from the Loftboro Schnooks. My mind was just like, what if I don't, what if my family is gone when I get home? Kelleher's family was safe thanks to the quick thinking of passing drivers who saw the flames, which had spread into her daughter's bedroom and knocked on their door. If I didn't have them, I wouldn't have anything in this world. They are everything to me. The St. Louis Fire Department believes the fire started in the vacant home next door in the 4700 block of Compton, which Kelleher says has been a nuisance for years. I've called the cops on that house at least over 30 times. And it's been just nothing but squatters for the last two and a half years that I've had to deal with. The cause of the fire is still under investigation, but Kelleher believes she knows what may have started the blaze. The homeless guy who had set the fire here at this house there's a back house on the property. He had set that on fire as well two weeks prior. However, she says due to the lengthy process to evict squatters and the transient nature of the homeless, there's not much police can do under Missouri law. It's frustrating because like, I understand that people are homeless and they're having a hard time and their lives are you know, difficult. Everybody's life is difficult right now. This is just a difficult time for everybody. But at the same time, it doesn't give you the right to just destroy things and then on top of it, destroy other people's lives along with it. My kids could have died and I could have been without my family. Reporting in South St. Louis. My mommy's real Miss Joy. It's holding Kerwicki, five on your side. The Kelleher family is staying in a hotel until they can work out their future living arrangements. If you would like to help them out, you can look for this story on KSDK.com under the As Seen on TV tab. Just in